Hey folks, Sheila here from Design Files. In today's video, I just wanted to share the latest updates that we've added to the 3D Floor Planner for you. So we've included a new tool that is gonna make it really quick and easy for you to add in detailed notes to all of your floor plans so that you can highlight certain areas that you want to make sure that your client or your contractors are made aware of. So down here, over here in the right side panel, at the bottom, you'll see that you've got the option for labels and lines. And over here, it's going to allow you to add in lines and arrows and text to your floor plans to create those detailed notes. So for instance, if you wanted to indicate what the distance was between the kitchen cabinet here and the kitchen island, the first thing that you might wanna do is pop up here to the measurement tool, click on that. You can then click on the edge of the cabinet, bring your mouse out over here and click on the edge of the actual island. And you can see that this is three foot five inches between the two. So if I wanna add a detailed note, one of the things I'm gonna first do is just exit out of the measurement tool option. And then I'm gonna pop over here to draw a line. So I'll click on that. Again, I'm gonna click on the edge of the cabinet and I'm just gonna drag my mouse out here and I'm going to click again to release it. Now that's gonna open up this panel over here where I can start changing up how this line looks. So if I want, I could do solid dashed or dotted. I can also add a marker to it. So if I'd like there to be an arrow on the end of it, I can add that in. I can change out the color of the font as well. And if you want, and you've got a specific hex code that you'd like to use, you can always add that in here. And below that, I can also change the thickness of the line. So I can make it as thick or as thin as I like. Now, below that option, you're gonna see that you can add a label to this line. So if I just wanted to say three foot, five inches between, I'll just add that in and you'll see that it's going to appear on the actual floor plan. So now I've got this new note added in. And if I want to duplicate this note and use the same style for other notes on my floor plan, I could just click the duplicate option here, bring it over, and then I can pull on these dots here to rearrange this note. And then I can indicate here okay, what is the distance between the rug and the back of the sofa? In this case, I actually know that it's two foot three inches. So I'm gonna pop into my note over here and I'm just gonna change this out and I'm gonna say two foot three inches and I'll get rid of between because I just need to indicate what the distance is there. So you can use this new note feature to add in additional uh, details to your floor plans. It doesn't always have to have a line added to it. If you just wanna add text, you could do that as well. You can see that I added it down here to indicate that this is a wall mounted TV. So for instance, if I wanted to just indicate that this was the fridge, I would use the text label option here, click on that. I'm gonna click directly onto the fridge. I'm gonna type in my note right here and I'm gonna change the font size to make sure that it matches all the other notes that are on my floor plan. So everything is the same size. So there you have it. That's how it works. It's really quick and easy to use and it's gonna give you that added flexibility to add in those detailed notes that you really wanna make sure everyone is aware of when they're looking at your floor plans. So pop into your Design Files account, give this new feature a try, and as always, let us know what you think. Thanks so much for watching.